Are you owning your dreams right now? I really enjoy helping people do challenging things. I was a skydiving instructor for a long time. I taught people how to jump out of airplanes and land parachutes. For the last 10 years, I have been tutoring and teaching people who are preparing to take the LSAT, the law school admission test, which is a pretty brutal exam. I also work as a personal and professional development coach. I work with leaders and professionals and students and help them achieve some pretty amazing goals in their lives and in their careers. One really hard lesson that I've had to learn is that I can't take ownership of somebody else's dream for them. So I tend to get really invested in the people that I help and in their goals and in their dreams. I really wanna see people succeed and I'll work really hard to help someone succeed. But they have to really take ownership of whatever it is that they want to accomplish. I tell people sometimes that in order for me to teach someone to skydive, they've got to jump out of the airplane. You know, I really like to windsurf and I like teaching people how to windsurf, but I can't teach you how to windsurf if you're not willing to get in the water. And that's kind of what I mean by taking ownership of your dreams. When we look at things that you want to accomplish in your life, are you willing to jump out of the airplane? Are you willing to get in the water? Are you willing to really commit to that dream, to that goal that you want to accomplish and do what you need to do to make it happen? Nobody's going to commit to it for you. Nobody's going to take ownership of that dream for you. My dream right now is to help people as much as I can, to do work that I enjoy doing, to create a life with my wife that we both enjoy living, and then to spend as much time as I possibly can windsurfing. And that's what I did today. I went windsurfing all day. That's what I did yesterday too. And it's the middle of the week. It's a Tuesday. And there is work that I definitely could be doing. I've got bills to pay. I have commitments that I've made and deadlines that I'm facing. And it would have been really, really easy for me to say, nope, you know, I got to work. But it was a really, really, we had two really, really nice windy days in a row. Just really great conditions for windsurfing. And so I made a choice to live my dream and to honor my dream and to take ownership of my dream and do what I wanted to do and needed to do to make that dream a reality, which for me this week was going windsurfing. Last week, I worked hard. I was in my office a lot. The rest of this week, I'm gonna be working hard. But you have to make time in your life for the things that you're dreaming about, for the things that you want to happen in your life. Nobody else is gonna do that for you. People will help. People are gonna to wanna to help you, but people can't do more to make your dream a reality than you're willing to do yourself. So what's your dream right now? What's the big thing that you wanna accomplish in your life or in your career? What are you doing today to make it happen, to take ownership of that dream and make it a reality?